So, but if you don't know the, if you don't know all the different breaks in the game, there's a Chill Penguin will freeze Flame Mammoth stage. Storm Eagle's plane will crash into Spark Mandrel stage, uh, which causes the wreckage right here, and then the power outages that you'll see in a little bit. There we go, power outage. I'm actually gonna have to come back here once I get Boomer Kawanger's weapon, because all of his upgrades are needed. You need Boomer Kawanger to get them. Damn, my sub tank's full. Good stuff. See, there's a sub tank down there, but I can't get to it because I don't have I don't have Boomer Kawanger's weapon. So there's also a heart tank in here that's up on a high ledge that you need Boomer Kawanger's weapon to get. Now that I have the X-Buster, I might be able to, I mean, I've gotten that heart tank with, uh, I've gotten the heart tank with a well-placed dash jump, and I mean, I'll try it a couple times for the sake of this video to show you that it can be done, but frankly, if I don't get it after a little while, I'm gonna, oh my god, fucker, if I don't get it after a little while, I'm just gonna say screw it and move on because I'm not going to waste all kinds of time doing it. You die, sub-boss. You die very quickly! Oh! No! Damn it! Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me, die! Yeah! And by the way, for those people who don't know, like I didn't for years, L and R can change your weapons on the screen without having to go into the menu. <laughs> I'm sure that would have saved me a lot of hassle earlier on in my life. But I foolishly did not know it, never figured it out. And when I was a kid, I would foolishly trade it in a bunch of my old Mega Man games. So then I was stuck with the anniversary collections for a while. I keep thinking this is Metroid I'm trying to duck. Um But uh See there's the hard tank. Haha! -ha! Success! But, uh, I foolishly traded in so many of my old Mega Man games, and uh, I just got back my old NES ones. I have one through six now for my NES, and uh, I just got them again. And I, sadly, I paid you know $120 for them. That's not that bad of a deal considering I got them off eBay. I gotta wake up my laptop again. It's not a bad deal, considering I got them off eBay, and I mean, with the manuals like I got them, the only one that didn't have the manual was, I believe, one. And I got five dust sleeves with it, so I mean, $120, it could have been a lot worse. You know, I could have wasted a lot more money if I had time. Yes. <laughs> For a second, I thought that was the electric spark, and I'm like, wait a minute, I don't have electric spark yet, and it's purple. I love him. It's like, woohoo, light show! Break it down! Break it down! Break it down! Oh god, I hate when he doesn't freeze. You suck! Ha! Shuck on you! Aha! Shuck on you! Aha! Shuck on you! Aha! You're dead! <laughs> Sorry, that was a little repetitive. I hate Sigma though. In fact, I'm actually just gonna record the Mavericks. And I'm gonna do my thing, break up the video, break up the audio, put it into 10 minute segments for YouTube, and then I'm going to actually, uh, I'm actually gonna stop there for about a week, and I'm gonna waste an ass load of time practicing Sigma, because, frankly, I suck.
I am notorious for wasting a half hour in the first stage because of that stupid flipping platform area, and then trying to climb the tower before Vile, and ugh. Then you add in all the Maverick clones, and it's just not pretty. I would not put it up in that shape. Alright, but, right here, you'll find that Bubble Bat from Mega Man 2. Now, if you wander back forth here, this is a great place to do your sub-tanks. That, and... Bubble Bat has, I believe, a 33% chance of always dropping a 1-up when he dies. So, it's worth it to come here if you need life. I'm just going to show you this. Except for it's not working out too well for me right now. Wish I had another sub-tank that I could fill, but I'll get one in this level. Bubble Bat, die. See? Life. And see what I usually do is I just wander back and forth here, kill all the bats, go back. See? Life. He's making up for the six times I walked past him that I didn't get a life out of him. He feels bad. He ripped me off. Okay, continuing on. I don't think I need to show you anymore, because I'm pretty sure I got around nine lives. Oh! Stupid bat, get away from me. I'm busy. I'm really good at backtracking and bringing back, like, one bat in this stage. Okay, now this guy, I'm gonna hang out right up here. Ugh, lag! Now, personally, I can kill him. And I usually do, because it's fun. Play it's the Mets. But here's my sub-tank that I wanted. And now I'll just let him run his course and he'll kill himself on the spikes. The second one, you need to race him, or kill him, which I usually do. God, how many lives do I have? You can get them if you need sub-tank energy, but... I got one full, I really don't need two right now. Armored Armadillo is that tough. And I'll pick up plenty throughout the rest of this level. Just have to be careful to not get hurt, otherwise I won't be able to put it in my sub tank. Like that! And seeing X2, the best place I've found to fill your sub tanks is Wheel Gator. Sorry, sometimes I get X2 and X3 mixed up, so if I do that and you call me out on it, I apologize. I mean, if there's any other games you guys want me to do right away, just send me a, just send me an email requesting them. Or just, you know, post a comment, you know, something. Just tell me you want it, and I'll give it to you. I, I, I'm aiming to please here. My goal is your entertainment. Now, granted, there are some games that I'll be like, uh, no. Whether it be I don't have it, or I just don't feel like it, I might tell you that I'll do it later. Oh, there we go. For a second, I was getting freaked out. I'm like, oh, come on. No, get off screen so I can change my weapon back. Sure. And here's the heart tank. I've almost got them all now. If you notice, my health bar is like twice its original size. Which, yes, that means it takes longer to... F hey, I want that. Oh my god, I almost spiked myself. Oh, and of course... Ow! Screw it, then. This is my fun part. I like doing this. I like fearing the pink mist. Oh my god, holy lag! This is where the open caps will be if you have all four upgrades, all hard tanks, all sub tanks. Basically, get everything and get to Sigma, and you can come here and die repeatedly, and you'll get the Hadoken. Which is performed just like a Street Fighter. It's forward quarter circle, and then punch or fire. Alright, time to break your armor, punk. He's good at doing that to me. I'll shoot as soon as the match starts and then he dodges. Fine. I'll be that guy. Fine, I'll be that guy. It seems that I've broken the game, or not. Yeah! Face shot! In your face, Army Armadillo.
I have a really cool couple techno remixes for this for his stage song. Though I kind of didn't like it because it was my father-in-law's ringtone for a while, and uh, yeah, he decided to get angry at me and call me like 52 times in one hour. So yeah, so I didn't quite care for that song for a while, which is probably part of the reason I would do this game up to Armored Armadillo and then quit.